I was, uh, I was born in Stockport, uh, close to the Stockport Football Club ground. Um, my mother and father, very definitely working class, mum, housewife, dad was a skilled engineer at the local factory, um, lived in a terrace house with um, two bedrooms, one of which was converted into rooms for myself and my sister. Um, early, early life was really, really quite good. I saw my old teacher and he said, um, I think you'd be better suited to going to somewhere like Manchester Polytechnic, as it was called yeah. at the time, where the, where the teaching style will be much more akin to what you've been used for, lecturing style. Um, and it, and it, proved, um, it proved a really good decision. It was a sandwich degree. So I went out to industry. I went to a, um, a, a big factory making marine engines uh, first year. And then I did a couple of stints with uh, NatWest Bank. With me, my parents don't really know everything about university. So when the uh, first generation scheme is the one that's provided all these things for me, it's the other things that you need to do to get to university, the jobs that you can get out of it, like all these little bits that your teacher, Mr. Stark, must have helped you with, that first generation has helped me with. And so not everybody is as lucky as I was to have a teacher who took sufficient interest in me to spend a little bit of extra time counselling me. Uh, where, and, fir and first gen generation sort of bridges the gap um, that sometimes your parents and teachers can't fill because they haven't got the same experiences. So um, your parents, like mine, didn't go to university. And, and so they haven't got any perception of what it's really like. They sort of know, my mum and dad yeah. sort of knew it was a good thing. So first generation to help them as much as you make that leap into the unknown is, is, is really great. Um, I wish I'd sort of had it. So it's the first generation scheme is like mainly seen as in someone that's always there yeah. throughout the process during university. Yeah, I wouldn't be the person I am today without the education I received at Manchester Met. It's therefore about um, helping other people to achieve their um, best uh, as a consequence of going to university.